cannot hide from me. No matter what form you choose to wear, let your true self be revealed. Diablo. Adria has betrayed us completely, and Leah's soul is lost. Through her, Diablo has been reborn as the prime evil. All the powers of hell are his to command. The high heavens tremble, and the angels are helpless before Diablo's assault. Only I remain to set things right. And rid the world of Diablo's evil forever. Heavens, what have we done? to die when my husband did why am i still alive go from here and lead a good life make the sacrifice mean something what good is that to me why couldn't it have been me instead do you still think we'll live through the day absolutely you will survive but you're not sure if you will survive i've trained all my life for this I believe it is my destiny. Mom, where did Leah go? Is she dead? I hope so, love. There's no point in running, is there? Nowhere in the world is safe. This is the end. Not while I still live. This place will keep you and your children safe. I will see to it. Got some new items for the... We can't all be warriors. Someone needs to sell the equipment. Hope. Do not look down, my friend. Even in the darkest of times, there is always hope. Hope for a better day. Hope for a new dawn. Or just hope for a good breakfast. You start small, uh, then see what you can get. I never quite expected my life to end this way. 
How did you think you would die? It was smothered by a harem. Or, or uh, more likely, uh, chilled by the jewel I seek. Now, who would have thought that the entire world would die together? I can't complain. It's not as though I can say my life was not long enough. We aren't dead yet, Shen. We can fight Diablo. I'm glad my boundless confidence is rubbing off on you. Uh, could you give some of it back? A fat merchant never ran. Not even when he had a chance. I wonder why. You knew this was coming, didn't you? Of course, Chelsea. What's the point of seeing the future if you don't stop bad things from happening, Miriam? That's the point of the future, love. It keeps coming. You don't win a duel by blocking the first blow and going home. So you just let Leah die? I had to. Diablo was always going to come back. But now you are here to stop him. And in your grief and rage, you will, my Chelsea. You were gravely mistaken, my friend. I could not see through an illusion of such power, such treachery. There's no magic that could. When I think of what she suffered through, we must find a way to stop Diablo. The Prophet would never forgive me if he knew my part in unleashing this terror upon the world. I could not see the truth. You must think me very foolish. No more than any of us. That is kind of you. I have devoted my life to studying the arcane, and yet... I was not skilled enough to act when it truly mattered. If you are reading this, my husband and I are both gone. We would like to be buried side by side, preferably in a sunny spot. Oh, and please don't bury my husband's sword with us. He won't need it anymore. I guess he can finally retire. Thought I could make my wife's death mean something. It doesn't matter now, does it? Of course it does. You are the finest blacksmith I've ever met. Right. I'm sure that's a comfort for Leah now that she's gone too. Oh, I've been a fool. You don't get to make things right. This world isn't made for redemption. If I had known what that cow Adria was up to, I would have slit her throat. Magic or no. She will not live long once Diablo is dead. Of all people, I should have seen this coming. I allowed myself to believe this, this fiction that Adria was other than I suspected her to be. And now, the world is lost, and it is my fault. We all saw in Adria what we wanted to, Leah included. Put aside your shame. We must go make this right. Ever since Adria betrayed us, I've been thinking about how Magda used to share the leadership of the Coven with another. What do you mean? Twenty years ago. Just before the darkening of Tristram, they had some sort of falling out, and the other leader disappeared. I think that other leader might have been Adria. It does make sense. Adria left to find Diablo in Tristram, while Magda stayed true to the coven. Well, we've had a good time, right? Shame about our imminent deaths. You don't seem very upset. You don't choose this life and expect to live to an old age. Still, it's the women I feel sorry for. Which women? All of them. There will be heaving bosoms and torn clothes all across the land when word spreads that I've fallen in battle. Uh-huh. You must.
must miss your family during times like these. No point in it. I'll never see them again. Don't say that. They still live. My brother's wife thinks I was involved with his imprisonment and he believes her. What? As low as I am, I would never frame him. Not even to win her back. But they won't hear a word of it. For all the gold I send to them, I receive nothing in response. At least Lyndon brought the mood up a little bit. Lot of bloody good this keep did us in the end, eh? The killing blow came from one we trusted. I thought we were going to lose. But not like this. All those deaths, and it didn't even matter. We may as well have run. Right. At least then we would have been home with our families when the end came. Our end is not yet written. Stand and fight, and you might return to your family as a hero. Okay. Now to go to the Diamond Gates. Imperius, you cannot mean to face Diablo again. Your wounds are barely healed. The heavens burn. This is your fault, Tyrion. And you, Nephilim, look below and see what your kind has wrought. This aspect of valor condemns us. This will be difficult. The Diamond Gates have stood since the light first broke over the high heavens. Now they lie in ruins. Imperius is right. I am the cause of this. Diablo did this, not you. You did everything in your power to prevent this devastation. Long ago, my brethren and I voted to decide the fate of man. I cast the final vote that spared you from extinction. Now humanity has birthed the prime evil. Tyriel, you believed in us. You became one of us. Now you must live as a mortal and surrender your fears to hope. Stay here and wallow in your misery if you like. But I'm going on. But you don't understand. Hope has been silenced. Dire tidings, indeed. Gaze upon the destruction I have wrought. It will be the last thing you see. It's got to destroy the Nephilim. I do not fear you, Nephilim. You'll find only death in this eternal realm. And the forgotten boss. Because he's not in the adventure mode. He's farmed by a lot of wizards way back when. Great place where you could stay in Archon for forever. I shall write my destiny in Diablo's blood. You can watch all of creation burn, or you can help me now. Perhaps fate can be changed. Quickly then, Aureo, Archangel of Hope, has been captured by Ragnarok, the Lord of Despair. I will free her, and then hope will be restored to the heavens. These are the Gardens of Hope. The Archangel Aureo cannot be far. Not ready yet. Your spirit is free now, Angel. I 
get a fortune shrine. One of the... There's two ways to still get a fortune shrine. The other one being the staff that you get a random shrine when you kill... Or you have a chance of getting a random shrine. When you kill demons. Need more time. Not ready yet. Your defenses are nothing. Still waiting. My armies flow through the hill rifts. Heaven will be destroyed long before you set one foot into the silver spire. Now the free hope. Only once in the history of Sanctuary has an ever been as powerful as me. His name was Odysseus. Heard of him, the one who sacrificed himself to save the world. I thought it was just a myth. He was no myth. Because of his noble sacrifice, I saw the inherent potential in your kind. As such, I voted with Aurea to spare mankind from annihilation. You made the right decision. Without me, heaven would fall before the prime evil. You can see the future. I see the myriad streams of possibility, all intertwining and weaving into one another. I can hear them echoing forward into eternity. With so many paths before you, how do you know which one to take? I am not called to be a champion as you are. My role is simply to observe. Have you seen the fates of the Prophet? I know of that name. But the one who bore it lived and died long before your time. I see. How does the scroll of fate say this will all end? Doom and darkness. These heavens ruined. The angelic coast broken. Diablo victorious. I will not let that happen. As I have said, Nephilim, your destiny is unwritten. You alone may change these dark times. Thank you, Nephilim. I hoped the scroll of fate was wrong, that harmony would once again fill this troubled realm. I see now that all hope lies in you. You can no longer be bound by the chains of fate. With my blessing, you can now dispel Diablo's corruption. It hides the rifts which bring his cursed servants to this hallowed place. The rifts must be closed. We will not fail you. Diablo sought to bring despair down upon heaven, but I have destroyed his champion and restored hope. I thought this would bring Tyrael back to his senses, but he remains lost. Nevertheless, I must push on and eradicate Diablo's hellish portals. I knew he would come. That a champion from the mortal world would light our darkest hour. 
Your courage and nobility shine out across this realm, blinding our enemies. My Lady Aria, I promise your song of hope will never be silenced. I know you will do all you can, for this is your hour. Go forth with my blessing and show all creation why the Nephilim are the future. Can you help Tyrael? I fear he is lost in doubt. He blames himself for this. There is a shadow upon his heart, but it will pass. Remember, he chose to be a mortal, and he must overcome this despair as a mortal. We have little time left, and we may need Tyrael's assistance. Have faith in him. Of all the Archangels, his light has always shown the brightest. In this our darkest hour, he will ensure that justice prevails. What are you going to do now? Though the angelic host is scattered, we are not defeated. I will try to rally them as best I can. Yes, they have always flocked to your call during times of crisis. Or, um, so I have heard. Our histories have reached your people? That is indeed promising. I pray that this day will end in another tale of victory. Can Diablo still be defeated at this point? Only in the light that lies within you, Nephilim. I will take heart from it and hope for your victory. The future is ever writing itself. Unknowable, just beyond sight and touch. How to find the hell portals? Need more time. Of hell. The demons come from Diablo's realm of terror and the burning hells. The gateway must be shut. I am stronger still. Not ready yet. Silver City. Now only one rift remains. That is not the only hell rift. The flow of my legions will not stop. Okay, what do I have? That has movement speed still. Yes. Um, that has three sockets.
I'm closing in on having some some defenses in my skills. Definitely don't want to get rid of my my belt of. If you insist. I'm sorry for what I said before. I was upset. I don't know what it is, but I feel better. Like things can be made right. Would you say you're feeling hopeful? Yes, that's it exactly. My wife would not have wanted me to wallow in my misery. She would have wanted me to do everything I could to help you win this battle. And you can win. I know that now. I found a strange document on one of the angel's bodies in the high heavens. It is very old, maybe centuries even older than I. That does sound interesting. We know so little of the angels. What is it about? I am not certain. The script is very old and foreign to me. When I saw the angel, he was dying. But even though he was in great pain, he reached out to me with the document in his hand, like he wanted me to take it. By the time I approached him, he was still. His spirit had already gone. There's no stopping you, is there? My life has led me to this moment. I could not rest even if I wanted to. She's back! Can you believe it? She's back from heaven. Not just that, she's winning! What a rocket! What does it take to stop that one? Even if we live long enough to have grandchildren, they'll never believe us. You amaze me. So much loss and you keep fighting. Thank you. Bloody hell! You're still alive! What in blazes do they make people out of where you come from? The same thing you're made from, friend. I need you to hold these people together. Can I count on you? Absolutely, my lady. If you can charge the gates of heaven on your own, I can keep spirits up around here. You there! Demotrius! Stop moping about! If this was your funeral, I'm bloody well certain you'd have been told! Sorry, sir. I heard Jason's mom say that you were sent by Akarak to save us. Is it true? It is my destiny to be here, and Akarat was not involved. I believe that I will save you, child. I looked through the portal. You did not. Did so. It's scary in there. I was a fool to doubt you. You truly are a wonder. I don't remember if I heard this one in the save. Obviously, they've all been gray because, well, I actually forgot to come back when they before I saved Hope. Do, do, do you think that Leah is lost forever? Diablo consumed her. She is gone. Do you not think Leah's soul is stronger than that? But, oh, but then sometimes I, I forget that you have not seen everything that I have seen. You always dodge around the truth. Who are you? Uh, what am I? I am covered as Shen, of course. Uh, no more, no less. To some that has meant one thing, to others another. When will you give me a real answer? When the sun sets in the east and the shore swallows the tide. Uh, when the moon smiles upon the day and the blind man sees once again.
So, now you know. The Nephilim are not in the Scroll of Fate. Heard it from Fate himself. You can write your own destiny. Write my own destiny, hmm? Then how is it you are able to see my future? Perhaps I have my own Nephilim powers, eh? That and you are quite predictable. Um, do I have enough to turn? Yeah. This one doesn't need dust for us. But it also isn't really that important. Okay, I think I've talked to everyone now. Yeah. That's exciting. Jim Curious, the Archangel of Valor, is the greatest warrior in all of creation. He revels in war and combat, and has led the hosts of heaven to innumerable victories. With Mount Vale's absence, it is Imperius who now rules over the Angiris Council, seeking always to defend the High Heavens from any foe. Still waiting. Your defenses are nothing! People. You think to destroy the Rift Oculus? My fiends will tear you apart! The Hell Rifts are closed. You have far exceeded my expectations, Nephilim. But there is not a moment to waste. Quickly, you must make your way to the Silver Spire. The Hell Rifts are closed, but it is of no matter. Soon there will be nothing left of these high heavens. All creation will be the realm of terror. I don't know, he seems to keep changing the goalposts. Didn't he say that it would be destroyed by before I could even get to the crystal colony or um the spire of heaven? Need more time. Yes, my friend. I am ready to again fight by your side. I was wrong to give in to despair. You have shown me there is still a chance for victory. But we must hurry. Even now, Diablo makes his way to the Silver Spire. I finally understand. Your kind faces death and darkness every day. Yet still you find the courage to move forward. It is an honor to be one of you. I knew you would understand with time. I need to go back. Magnificent. Oh, this had more intelligence. This is well crafted. You said that the Crystal Arch is the heart of heaven. Please explain that. It is older than time itself. And over the eons, this shining realm took shape around it. It thrums with living light and sound that courses through the very fabric of the Silver City. Were the angels born from it as well? Yes. Like 
musical notes in a grand chorus. Angels are the manifestation of the Archer's intrinsic harmony. The purest expressions of this harmony were my brethren, the Archangels. It seems the harmony between you was broken long ago. Yes, but hope has returned. And as you mortals are fond of saying, it is not over yet. I'm doing this here because, well, this is about how far I got last time. And I tried to talk to him before I went through the portal. He just kept Inter or he interrupted a couple times to tell, to say how bad he felt about the state heaven was in. I fear that if we defeat Diablo, Leah's innocent spirit will die with him. I won't believe that. No matter how long it takes or how far the journey, I will never rest until her soul is at peace. You are right. Leah knew the protective spells of the Horadrim. Diablo took control over her body. He can never twist her mind. I know that you and Ariel voted to spare mankind, but who voted to destroy us? Imperius. Malthael abstained, but it was counted against you. Malthael abstained? Was it out of cowardice? He was no coward. He was wisdom itself. Until his disappearance. The Endurus Council has been broken ever since. Whatever became of Malthael? Long ago, when Anarius and his ilk stole the World Stone to create Sanctuary, Malthael became consumed with discovering its whereabouts. As the Archangel of Wisdom, he was tortured by his inability to recover the sacred artifact. Where is he now? Some say he haunts the silent halls of Pandemonium, forever seeking answers to the unknowable mysteries of life and death. What exactly is the prime evil? It is the sum total of all seven evils housed within one body. There is an ancient legend, known only to a few, of the great dragon Tathamet, who was the original embodiment of evil. The legend says that he was ripped apart during an epic battle with Anu, and that the burning hells are composed of his remains. Who is Anu? Just as Tathamet was the ultimate evil, Anu was the ultimate good. It is said by some that the Crystal Arch is all that remains of this great warrior. So Diablo is Tathamet reborn? In a manner of speaking, yes. Okay, and I think yeah, that's it. So now I can go through the other portal. One can only hope, but now we must stop Diablo before he reaches the crystal arch above us. Yep, and that's why I did it then. His talk grayed out. I don't know if it definitely would have. But it looks like the well, at least Irena has the other things. I spoke with Ethereal, and he helped me translate the document. It was written by an angel who saw promise in humanity. He began to teach a group of young women who had killed the demons their masters summoned. You mean they were you and your sisters? None other. The 
prophet I have followed for so many years. He was an angel. That is why Tyriel seemed familiar to you. Yes, but I do not know whether the prophet was the dying angel I met or not. The writings say that he worked in absolute secrecy. Ethereal knew nothing of them. Then you must find a new path through the world without him. You are right. And I hope that path will still be with you, my friend. It was just her. I thought I'd heard or reheard everything else. I guess I could have destroyed the few things I do have. Diablo will corrupt the crystal arch atop the silver spire unless he is stopped. Should he succeed? Heaven will fall. Everything has led to this moment. Tyriel and I will fight our way to the summit, where I will finally face Diablo. The corruption is thicker here. Though I forsook my home, to see it again like this, any joy I might have had is replaced with sorrow. Upwards, we must make it to the summit. How does it feel, knowing you helped me become the prime evil? For all your mighty deeds, all you really accomplished was unleashing me upon the world. Some savior you are, Nephilim. Diablo is climbing the spire to the Crystal Arch. We must hurry. I lived only to serve my master Belial, but you killed him and unleashed the prime evil on the world. An illusion! Spirits are no longer held by Diablo's corruption angels. Riches await us! I knew Inarius long ago, when he was still among the angels. But he grew weary of battling the demons after a time, and he began to secretly conspire with demons in order to forge a peace. The demoness Lilith became his greatest ally in the Hells, and many other demons and angels joined his cause. After he gained a following, Inaria stole the sacred world stone and used it to create and conceal a world he called Sanctuary. Demons and angels alike fled there, and some of them including Inarius and Lilith, fell in love. Many of these unions resulted in children. They were called the Nephilim. Still waiting. Wait, there is something different here. I sense it as well. Be on your guard. Thank you. 
Since we've both fallen from grace, Tiddy. <laughs> Come, embrace your former lieutenant. The cold hand of death reach in the pen will suck him. Look beneath you and see the ruin of heaven. Okay, let's see. Your task will soon be done. The angels will then have no choice but to value mortals, thanks to you. You may be right. Of course I'm right. Look who you're talking to. Have I ever steered you wrong? No. But you don't always tell me everything I need to know. All for your own good, Chelsea. All for your own good. Okay, so that would be 16.2. So yeah, this will be better once I put a ruby in it. Oh. That. Would be better for you, even has the ink on me. Use this. I know what I fear. For long years, I fear the jewel of Durgis would fall into the wrong hands, that its evil would be unleashed upon our world. But in the sight of this, in the sight of all this destruction, I can hardly look or even think upon a jewel, even one as terrible as Durgis. You must save us. Thank you for everything. Thank you so much. Is it time to go home yet, Mum? Soon, love. Soon. Is this the last battle? Perhaps it is the last, though I doubt it. But you will be safe when Diablo is destroyed. I don't want to be safe. I want revenge. You will have it. I promise. You have one last scrap ahead of you, I hear. Might I ask you a favor? Certainly. What is it? When you're killing Diablo, and I have no doubt you will, think of my lads, will you? Make him pay for all of this. I will. Gladly. My husband's blood bought us victory against the Asmodan's armies. Don't let it be for nothing. You have my word. Got some new goods. Better buy them before someone else does. <laughs> this is the end, isn't it? One way or the other. Good luck, hero. One last fight for our hero, and we can go home. Don't you wish you could help? Ha! I don't think she needs it. I have watched you for some time now, and I would have you know that I am impressed. Well, you've slain a fair number of foes yourself. Your prowess is undeniable, but I meant you are a strong man who stands for what is right. That is odd, coming from a criminal. I can be wrong on the details, like who owns this jewel or that coin. It does not mean I am wrong when it counts. I've got a little surprise for you, Lyndon. Is that so? It's gold, and a lot of it. I'll go with you to Kingsport after things have settled down and help you repay the Merchant's Guild and free your brother. You're joking, right? You look like you're joking. Even I know this isn't a joking matter. I'm happy to help you. I'm speechless. Well, I'm not holding my breath. I don't care if you have to burn the heavens down to their foundations. Kill Diablo for what he's done today. 
Okay, let's destroy everything. And continue on. It is not far now. I only hope we are not too late. I can feel Diablo's corruption closing around the light of heaven. The Angelus Council is no better than the prime evils themselves. We are just pawns in their cruel games, and now you help the worst of them all. Cain would never say that! Not ready yet. Love this music. Still waiting. Never. I see you did not heed my warning. Or perhaps you think yourself strong enough to fix me. Let's find out, shall we? Imperius, stop this madness. Diablo is the enemy here, not the Nephilim. Tyrion, I will deal with you soon enough. I will... What is this? No! Diablo has reached the Arch! No. Diablo has begun extinguishing the Crystal Arch. That's why the angels have fallen. If its light should go out forever, we must defeat Diablo before that happens. It's down to us mortals, Tyrion. It is fortunate you gave up your wings. Diablo's vile corruption bars our path. Stand back. Eldruin's light shall clear the way. The gate has been opened, Nephilim. This last trial is yours alone. I couldn't have made it this far without you, Tyrael. It was an honor, but this is the moment you were made for. This is the hour of mankind's victory. See how you fare in my realm of terror. Only by defeating us can you return to your own realm. But none have ever crawled from the depths of their own terror. How tastes your fear?
Eradicated. All that you have known, all that you have ever loved, shall die along with you, Nephilim. I can't believe you really did it. Lyndon, are you crying? <laughs> no, no. It's raining. <laughs> it doesn't rain in the heavens. Well, it does now! <laughs> that was astounding! What you did back there! You're the greatest hero in history. Everyone in Kingsport will know your name if I have my way. They'll sing it for the rest of time. Hell, I will sing right now if you want me to. Well, it was all worth it. Everything. The cuts, the bruises, having to break bread with that Templar. Ah, just. You are like family to me now. I owe you the world, my friend. But now I'd better shut up before I make myself sick. Victory at last! There was never a doubt in my mind, friend. You are a true champion. So the Lord of Terror falls. May all the souls ravaged by his evil rest in peace. It's finally over. Many brave souls died in this war. Thanks to us, they did not perish in vain. I am returning to town. Let's see about what the viewer has to say. Okay, what's your other rank? 37 int, so yes. Thank you. Well, why won't you? I wonder if I dismiss you. I to see you again. Do I have things to say when I go back there? Oh no, you're here. Do you think we have a chance against all of our enemies? While there is life, there is hope. That is profound. It sounds like wisdom from the heavens. I'm no god. <laughs> oh, I know you too well to think that. How long did it take you to get here? Well, it was not very easy to find you. I had to search for days. When I woke up alone, I did not know what had happened. I wrote about it a little. You may read more if you wish. I felt no fear when they sealed the tomb before me. Only a sense of peace as my mind drifted away into the darkness. It seems I opened my eyes only seconds later and beheld the chamber in ruins, half buried in sand. I have left everything behind. Only hope guides me now. Victory at long last. I never dreamed our humble quest might lead to this. 
It's a story I will tell for many, many years. <laughs> and of course, I won't leave out the part played by one simple jeweler. I mean, it's about the same damage, but mine has more toughness. So we'll keep that for Arena. I wonder if I turn in the rest of this quest with these people, I have more to say. It seems a little weird if they have exactly nothing to say about me killing Diablo. one the prophet promised you are everything that all the angels and all of humanity could have hoped for and well you're awfully nice too i cannot believe it all came to pass just as the prophet wished i left everything i knew behind to fight with you it was the best choice i have ever made the day is one Diablo is vanquished, and all evil with him. I would not be so certain. True evil never really dies, does it? Time will tell. Yeah, I don't think that there is any kind of celebration, which is kind of sad. Yep, very sad. Can't even talk to the child. I would not be so certain. Time will tell. In the end, it was a mortal heart that saved. Two worlds from ruin and cast down the prying evil forever. day breaks for both angels and men. For mankind's greatest champion, the Nephilim, rose to confront the darkness that we, in our pride, would not face. place among you once again but this time as a mortal since justice has been met this day I will now stand as wisdom on behalf of those who risked all to save us Forevermore, we shall stand together, angels and men, in the light 
of this glorious new dawn.